At the end of this video, you'll learn how to cut and program and identify a Peaky using the kit system. First, just insert the customer original. Press scan key. The on-screen prompt lets us know to go ahead and put it in the iTool reader. Always make sure that you don't have any other keys or fobs directly above the iTool reader as well. And go ahead and press next. At this point, we're prompted to gather a little bit more information about the key we're testing. So we'll ask the customer, what is the year, make, and model, and go ahead and enter this information. So in this case, it's a GMC, Acadia, and the year was 2008. Press next. And as you can see, both fobs and keys come up in the results. We're gonna click on the key and it has been identified as a PGM 504. So go ahead and press next. At this point, we're notifying you to remind the customer of the cost of the chip key you're about to do for them, that it's not just a standard mechanical key, it's more expensive than that. Secondarily, on the P keys, you'll get a special instructions note that the key must be programmed in the vehicle and that the instructions for doing that are in the package. And now all we need to do is cut the key. Just load the key and press next. So we get the duplication successful message, we'll give it a quick brush, and I'll meet you in the car to finish the programming. In the customer vehicle, take the customer original key in the ignition, turn the ignition to on, but do not start the vehicle. Turn the key back off, insert your newly cut blank into the ignition. Again, just turn the ignition to the on position. Wait two seconds, 1001, 1002, and the key should be programmed. Please note, the example we just did was programming for a PGM 504 in specific. Each vehicle has a separate set of instructions. Please refer to the instructions on the package for each P key that you cut and program. If you need any help at all while you're programming chip keys, Heiko Tech Support is available seven days a week during normal store hours. The most important thing to remember about cutting and programming a P key is that it's just as easy as any standard mechanical key you ID and cut on the kit system. The only difference is the programming is completed at the vehicle.